Let's heat some things up in Allen, where Desmond Purnell has some good sports for us today. Hello, sir. Happy Easter to you, Steve. You know, John Kitna, he has an undeniable passion for the game of football. He showed it for as an NFL quarterback for 14 seasons. He showed it last year as an assistant coach for the Dallas Cowboys, and now as the head football coach of the Burleson Elks. Now, prior to serving as the Cowboys quarterback coach last season, Kidna spent three years as the head coach at Waxahachie. So Kidna, no stranger to the high school sidelines. After saying goodbye to the Cowboys, Kidna wanted to join a program with a family first mentality. And Burleson was the perfect fit. You know, that, that feel of that town and that, and that family feel of that town is everything that, that, uh, that I've been looking for uh, for a long time. What the buzz is really about is what John brings as a coach um, and how he mentors young men and young women in his program. And that's what the, the buzz is really about, is what he's bringing to the whole community. Due to COVID-19, Kidna hasn't had much face-to-face -face time with his new team, but the limited time he had was very impactful. Kidna, who has experienced success on every level of football, said his first message to his players, you have to be all in, message received. Our message, uh, it really doesn't change. We ask our players to do, you know, give us all you got all the time. His first meeting to meet the football team at Burleson High School I've never witnessed a more inspirational meeting than that day. And I immediately went and I called our principal and I said, I wish, I hope somebody got this on film because we just, we hired the real deal. You know, our job, what we're trying to do with our kids and our football program is to inspire and unite a community. Now, when the Cowboys parted ways with Jason Garrett, a lot of his assistants were not retained. That included John Kitna. But based off the production that Dak Prescott had last season, the man had to be doing something right. As with Kitna as the quarterback coach last season, Dak had career highs in touchdown passes and passing yards. Kitna and Dak only worked together for one season, but Kitna says he hasn't met many players that possess a work ethic like Dak Prescott. I mean, most people are, will, will reach a level and say that's good enough. Dak never says that. And uh, it was challenging as a coach because uh, there would be some days in the middle of the season, he had a pretty tough game on Sunday. I, I better take it easy on him today. And he would not allow that to happen. And uh, he just wanted to be coached as hard as possible because he wanted to be the best he possibly can be. And uh, I just think there are very few people like that in the world. I got a feeling the Burleson Elks are about to get a lot more news coverage in that part of the woods. In Allen, I'm Desmond Parnell. Steve, we're going to send it back to you. I think you're right, sir.